Yo, 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 what is up, my fallopian tubers? Cesario from the barrio coming back at you with another video for your butt. And, um, man, the hobby's been good to me lately. Uh, as far as my collecting goes, um, I wanted to go to National. I, I just couldn't make it this year. I w really wanted to uh, knock a couple of cards off my Mickey Mantle checklist, you know, because I haven't been able to find them. Um, you know, at my local card places, my local card spots here. But man, I've been having like the best of luck. And because I did find one to knock off my checklist, check it out. All right. So this card right here is the 1961 307 World Series Game 2. So, bam, that's. Just check that sucker off my checklist, man. Super excited. I love... Uh, I mean, I, I'm i getting there. Obviously, the only card I'm not going to get probably ever is the 52 Tops. Um, and my set is the Tops Playing Days card. So it's Tops. You know, it's not every Mickey Mantle card. But uh, 52, I'll probably never get. It's just... You know, it's just like when someone's trying to complete a rainbow and they can't get the one of one. It's kind of the same for me. You know, as a player collector, I'm not going to get his rookie. Excuse me, not his tops, his tops rookie, but not his rookie card. All right, and um, so man, I got this, and you know me, I love my baseball cards. Um, this is how I do the Pepino PSA DNA. Mmm, damn, me, that cardboard tastes good. That vintage cardboard tastes so good. Every time I lick a, I lick a Mickey Mantle, it's like I'm losing my virginity in my mouth again for the first time again. All right, so man, sweet in the back, it has like the box score it tells you uh, for the game, like the old newspapers and stuff. Man, it's actually pretty cool. It tells you how all the runs were scored and stuff, all the action in the game. So got that. So went to the LCS and um, I bought a couple of packs. So this was one of them. Not, uh, this was at the hobby shop. So I, these are all, I believe, they're hobby packs. <laughs> I don't know how to tell. But I think these are hobby packs. I'll be taking these um, camping. All right? And I did make a couple of singles. Like this one. It looks just like the the stopwatch. That's pretty freaking awesome. It's exactly like the stopwatch. A promo card from the star of Bo Jackson. Probably overpaid for this. But like at the time, man, it just tickled my fancy. And when my fancy gets tickled, it convinces, it convinces me to um, try anything. Um, and then this Aaron Judge. I don't know why I bought it. I... Go label, um, one of my favorite sets ever. Love the go label. That's out of my price range now. I used to try to complete it, but I wouldn't even try anymore. And I'm pretty sure I have this, but you know, I was just I don't know. I don't have a checklist, so I just bought it in case I don't, and I need that for my set. But I'm I'm almost positive I do. Uh, and then I found the Mickey Mantle. All right, so check it out. Found the Mickey Mantle. Off my checklist, this one is the 65, uh, number three, home run leaders. So, bam, bam, knock that off my checklist. Mickey Mantle, Mickey Mantle, Mickey Mantle. So, got a Pepino DNA certify this card right here. Oh, man. Telling you every time it's like losing my virginity in my mouth when I lick a Mickey Mantle. Like a virgin licking cards for the very first time. So man, that is just a sweet, sweet pickups. Knocked two cards off my list, man. The back of this one has the home run leaders with Killer. Killer Brew had 49 that year. And Boog Pow, who got the nickname Boog. Boog from his sister who used to call him Booger. And then Mickey Mantle was at um, 35. So huge difference. Killer just took ran away with it that year. Uh, but sweet card. And then it also tells you the Grand Slams in the back. Like who hit the most Grand Slams this year. And that year was... Uh, a couple of guys had three Grand Slams that year. Every time I talk about Grand Slams, it always reminds me of Don Mattingly. One of the great facts about Don Mattingly... In his career, he hit six Grand Slams. He hit six Grand Slams in his entire career. But he did it all in one year, man. I always find that so amazing. All right, but anyways, man, 
I'm gonna put these Mickey Mantle. Oh, my Mickey Mantle box is actually right here. Put these in the Mantle box where my entire Mickey Mantle PC is. And uh, that's it, guys. Thanks for watching, man. Love the hobby, people. Let's keep collecting baseball cards forever. I said, Chill! <laughs> Have you seen my baseball? Here I come to save the day! I got a taco on my head, but don't call me Taco Head! Ah! Oh look, it's Sarah Jessica Parker! Cheers everybody, enjoy your infinity beer.